fact, man. You been getting money since getting money. People try each other's budget mules. These a niggas snitch. gonna start getting fucking disrespectful in this bitch. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. I know he said budget. Some fat ass beans. Beans on her head. Hey y'all, it's Marquavia Queen Smith. Hi, my name is Makiba. Hi, my name is Kayleen, and today we are trying each other's meals. But on a budget. I don't play about my money, and I don't play about my time. On a good week, like the money's right, invoices are not late, my food budget for the week is about $100. A hundred dollars? How much, how much could y'all eat for a week? Like, how much bread y'all need for a week? I don't know about other niggas, but I would go grocery shopping for like, not that week, but that month. You feel me? I go get some, uh, I would say my groceries is probably like well around like 189, some shit like that. Damn, I look smack. How much, uh, how much, uh, how much would y'all need for a week of eating? 180? Uh, it'd be like 180. What? What? Like that's a lot, or is that cheap? I don't know, cause y'all niggas is rich in here. <laughs> I need at least seven hundred. You need seven hundred, seven hundred a thousand a week. What you mean? So wait, that's what you. That's what you be getting right now, you rich ass nigga. Yo, food is pricey. I got some rich niggas in DFA. What the fuck? So your mom, yeah, your parents give you seven hundred dollars, a thousand dollars for food for a week. Nigga, they adopting? Niggas DK about the Walmart method. Niggas don't know. You gotta get DoorDash. To be honest, I don't be even DoorDashing a lot. Like, you feel me? I get actually good cooked meals. You feel me? That's why I'm trying to show you. That's nothing? Oh, my fault. That's nothing. Ooh, what the fuck you buying? Nigga, you fat? $700 a week for food? Shit. Hey, man. I grew up in a, I grew up in the slums, nigga. I'm accustomed to, to, to going a day without no food. I could go, I could dead go a day without food. What's good, Jayla? I oh, I gotta, I gotta hear this. I gotta. Hear this. Everyone, shut the fuck up. Right, so I missed all last week cause I was sick, and then I come home today and I find some papers on the door and it say I got caught September 26th or some shit for a complaint that I didn't go to school. So if you niggas don't see me, it's free Caden. <laughs> Nigga, what? Them niggas is about to send your ass to fucking juvenile prison for missing school. Yo. Shit is getting serious. You don't even you don't even get a suspension or a call home. You get called by the fucking cops. Nah, that is crazy, bro. Niggas about to take you to court. <laughs> Like, what do you get with 700? Yeah, like that ass, yo, yo, bro, restaurants? Wait, you only eat at restaurants for like a good week? Oh, do you mean like buffets? Yo, I haven't had a buffet in a minute. Eating, eating out at buffets all the time is kind of crazy. You, ain't gonna lie. you don't got to eat out. You don't got to eat out like, like fucking uh, restaurants and shit. Not gonna lie. I would dead eat Applebee's for a whole week, though. I'm not gonna lie. I budget on a good week. It's 350. I know it sounds crazy. I'm one person. I know. A budget? What's that? 350 on one person is crazy. I don't have a budget, but I spend responsibly. You usually got a budget when Nah, I don't have a budget. I'm not gonna lie. I just don't spend. Rent is due. Applebee's? Applebee's is literally like Bro, the Applebee's is probably like the best restaurant that I've ever eaten from out of all the restaurants I've been to. So I've been to like Lobster, uh, is it called lobsters? Lobsters and bur burgers and lobsters? Yeah, burgers and lobsters. White wolf fang. S uh, I, I didn't go to SDK. Del Frisco. Like, except for Benihana. Your taste buds are fucked. No, bro. I don't get nothing else but chicken Alfredo. And them beautiful, succulent fucking sticks of bread. Oh, shit. That shit is so good. Oh, oh, oh. And they have good chicken tenders. And good fries. You don't jack red lobster? Nigga, I fucking love red lobster, nigga. Where do you think I went for my birthday, nigga? I took I took my ass with my little yeah yeah. And we out we, we went to Red Lobster. I had like five biscuits home. 
Shit is fucking. I love that shit, bro. Nigga went to shit restaurants. See, bro, you over here. I don't want to hear your suggestions, gang. You over here spending seven hundred dollars on food. My fool, you living. You 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 eating lavish. My fool. Or you got bills to pay. If you have children, That's a fact. yeah, that budget's gone. I definitely owe my frugality to my parents. The person that taught me how. Yo to yo, yo, yo 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 yo. Is gone. I definitely. What? Why the fuck? You got rice and be is that beans, my nigga? Ew! Me oh my frugality to my parents. The person that taught me how to save was my mom. Hooters, Red Lobster, Olive Garden, Golden Car Rail. That's all I can think of. Hooters, nigga, yo ass be, yo ass be eating at Hooters, nigga, or you just you just be going over there to see some titties, nigga. Fucking got him. We got him. Yo, I heard, I did ass heard Olive Garden was fire. I would dare go to, like, I don't know why I'm not going to Olive Garden. Because, yo, where I'm at, there's a Red Lobster and there's an Olive Garden. I should, nah, I gotta go. Nigga be going to Hooters to see the teddies, to see the huzz. <laughs> Wait, which, what else you named? Golden Carell. Ain't that like a, uh, Buffet. It's not pornography. Yeah, it's not pornography, but you still seeing the has golden corral. Ain't that ain't that isn't that a buffet? That's a buffet, right? Me and Seti went there in Miami. Jesus Christ. Yo, that is like yo, that was dead ass the worst buffet I ever went to. Like like no funny shit. That shit was fucking disgusting, bro. Wow. Only thing that was valid was the jello, I swear to god. Cause she a penny pitcher. You know, my mom, she did say, do you got McDonald's money? She was very big on that. When it's not a good week, my- Yo, that's crazy. Cause thinking of that now, bro, McDonald's money if, to me is at least $26, $23. You bitches was broke. Your taste buds is fucked, Gaza. Nigga, you said Golden Corral, gang. And if you're referring to the Golden Corral in Florida, nigga, that shit was hurt. I've been to a way better. I feel like buffets are only valid if there's like a it's like a Chinese buffet. My grocery budget for the week is thirty. Ten is all I need. Ten is all you need for McDonald's, nigga. Nigga, what you gonna get for ten dollars, nigga? Uh, you you could I mean if you get in it from the store, you could get a six piece and some small fries. But you physically cannot get nothing for ten dollars. On DoorDash, I think, unless you you order like fucking hash browns or some shit. Pen Express, yeah, Pen Express is fire. I haven't, yo, I only had Pen Express one time, bro. Crazy. Thirty dollars. If I'm doing a low budget, right? It's like, damn, I'm down and out. My budget is about eighty dollars, but today it's fifteen. This bitch is broke as fuck. Fuck fifteen dollars, nigga. Fifteen dollars for the week, nigga. If I if I had to, cause I don't normally, I would just buy food. I buy food Saturday. I buy food Friday and Saturday, and most of those times I be I be spending over around like thirty dollars. Never forty. I try not to do forty, cause I be wilding. If I was to order from Chipotle now, bro. Them niggas be fucking taxing me like Franks and Beans was valid budget meals is legit. Franks and Beans, Franks and Beans is fucking crazy. You sound like you need to be in prison, nigga. I buy, I buy some shit from Chipotle, but that shit gonna come up to fifty dollars, gang. That's why I had to stop eating Chipotle, bro. Like, yo, what the fuck going on, man? These niggas is trying to rob me, man. Yo, what's good, Billy? What's happening? And niggas ain't saying my Nathan, the Daniels, nigga. Nate Daniels. They will each try each other's budget meal and rank them from one to ten. Being honest, the contestants with the highest ranking wins the competition. I made this budget dish. It is. It is pinto beans over basmati rice with fried plantains. Ew! Top of what top of? Yo, what type of struggle meal is that, gang? Yo, what was your yo bone? What was y'all budget meals, nigga? My shit is some. If you Jamaican or Caribbean, Caribbean, you feel me? You would know. My budget meal 
is bola beef and rice, which is basically corned beef with rice and ketchup. You feel me? They don't get no crazier than that. Chicken and rice. That's not a budget meal, gang. That's not a budget meal, gang. Grilled Franks is the only good Franks. That's a fact. Frank in the microwave. Bro. <sighs> ham sandwich. Okay. <laughs> Yo, ham sandwich. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why that shit is so funny. I think it's because of the way I'm, I'm saying. Yo, do y'all say sandwich or sandwich? Like sandwich. Like sandwich. Like S A M S A M which. I say sandwich. Like sandwich. Guys, what's your shoe size? I love and a half. Why are you, you trying to know the size of my beef? <laughs> nigga, no way you ate a sandwich. Just cheese. <laughs> Yo, nigga, a sandwich with just cheese, that's a grilled cheese sandwich. That's sanctioned. Yo, why I heard some dumbass nigga say they wanted to know is hot dogs a sandwich? Nigga, what? What the fuck are you saying, bro? Nigga said, is hot dogs a sandwich? Like, who you asking me right now, bro? I remember I had to eat a peanut butter and jelly tortilla. Oh, nah. <laughs> nigga said a tortilla nigga was trying to eat that shit. The fucking jelly was sliding out and shit. It's crazy. <laughs> that shit probably would be wavy, though. Nah, not really. Nigga had no bread. Let me think. Let me think. Because, yo, to be honest, I don't think noodles is uh, a struggle meal or a budget meal, to be honest. Nah, it's a it's a budget meal. I just I, I don't think it's a struggle meal. Yo, you know what's crazy? I just started eating noodles probably be like last year. All right, let me think. Struggle meal. All right, struggle meal cereal with like condensed milk. Don't even got enough. I don't even have no milk again. Gotta gotta make some milk yourself. What you know about making your own milk, bro? What noodles I got, nigga? I be getting the chicken. The cup, uh, I'll be getting the cup. The plantain is 50 cents. The 50 can cents? of beans is a dollar 25. And the basmati rice, it was a two pound bag for 5.25. This is genuinely the meal that I make when I am on a budget. I don't expect this to score very high, but- There's no said, way. Bring there's, your budget meal. Yo, bro, there's no way she eats this shit, bro. Meal, and like, this is my budget meal. Mm. <laughs> it's very bland. It looks a little dry. The beans look dry. I like sauce. There's no sauce. There's no nothing. It needs something on it. Like it needs some type of sauce, some type of liquid. There's no meat. I some really type don't of want liquid. What type of liquid? I ain't gonna lie. Just chill. Try this. Are y'all eating this? Yo, I'm gonna give you 30 bands. You gotta eat this shit. You gotta swallow it. Like. Now, don't even chew it. Swallow. I'm 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 giving you 30 bands. If I go to a bitch house and she don't have noodles, she has to be Ed. What are you doing with your life with no noodles on deck? Alright, <laughs> calm. Calm. I'm giving you 30 bands. You gotta eat the you gotta eat some 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 beans, planktons, and rice. You gotta swallow it, nigga. Swallow the whole plate. Are you doing it? It's just beans and rice? Ew. Oh no. Because I need meat. So we got. Oh, she said she needs that beans. Who wants to eat dry beans and dry rice? I'm not gonna lie, I'm allergic to beans, so I probably won't eat this. The plantains look like typical plantains. I think the best thing on this plate is probably gonna be the plantain. Bro, it's plantain. Why y'all keep saying plantain? Plantains. This tastes like they just boiled rice and water. Literally, the main ingredient in this whole meal is salt. The rice. Salt? The fuck is plantain? Plantain is uh is like fried bananas. It's not seasoned to my liking. The plantain's not bad. I think the best sweet plantain is the one that's plantain. Bro, you're so fucking literate. Not too hard. It's not too mushy. So I'll say the consistency of it is is good in that sense. I don't like the beans by itself. And the beans is trying its hardest to provide flavor to this. The meal as a whole does isn't like meshing well. If this wasn't cocoa butter, I nigga, that should look like some jail food. Even jail food would even look like that. I ain't gonna lie. I would say that a white person made this. No ingredient stands out because there are no ingredients. You know that. Damn. That smell that like when you go, it's like some people have a smell in their house. How much do you think this meal costs? Three dollars, two dollars. 
plantains are like, it's like a two for four. So rice be about two, three dollars. And beans be about one to one thirty-five. We had fifteen dollars and you only spent six thirty. If I were to eat this as a budget meal, I would have some type of meat. Like, where's the meat? We need to be fed correctly. Anything to add to this would make it a full. Mm. Yo, if anything that has beans in it, I wouldn't even add nothing to it. Probably add like some chili or some shit. I don't know. If she made a mofongo, I would've been like, oh, okay, like, cause I ain't nothing but plantains all mushed up. There's no flavor. <laughs> like, it's making me mad. We didn't want to feed us for real. And I came here to start. You don't want me to read this meal. <laughs> I'd give it a three. And that's only because of the sweet plantains. I'm gonna give her a three and a half for the plantains. And the whole three and a half goes to the plantains. The rice and the beans is literally a zero. Bro, plantains and beans is crazy. Zero. I decided to make this luxury budgeted meal of yellow rice and chicken with onions and bell peppers inside of it. And I made gravy. I made my gravy from scratch. So I got the chicken broth, it was 149. I got two chicken sliced cutlets. I got the peppers that was cut up already for 245. The yellow rice was 16 ounce, I got it for 299. And then I got an onion for 93 cents. And everything came up to 14.54. What makes my budget meal the best is, one, it's gonna be fulfilling. It's gonna taste really good, cause I love to season stuff. You're gonna be full, you're gonna be fulfilled, and you're gonna have a flavor. I am not gonna be full off that dirt shit. The fuck is chicken broth? What is that like? You never use chicken broth? Ah, nigga. The fuck is this? The fuck is that? Mm -hmm. full meal on a budget. Amen. Bro, do not sit here and try to specify chicken broth for being Jamaican, bro. Are you like, are you okay? Nigga? Are you good? Come on, bro. Nigga said chicken juice. No, nigga. Nigga, the fuck? I've never used that. This I probably had tasted it before, but like, nigga, nigga I'm not going to know what chicken broth is. Fucking chicken juice and shit. Well, the plating sucks, so it's gonna taste great. I don't think that she did the budget because I think all of us, we always go back to rice and chicken. I smell the chicken broth. It smells good. I can smell the chicken broth. I see some shredded chicken, red bell peppers, rice. Looking at this rice alone, it looks like Ben's with lots of cracked pepper. This one had sauce, but somehow the sauce dried up. <laughs> okay, it's cold. <laughs> First of all, the rice is good. It's nice and chewy. The rice tastes like it has gravy in it. It's a little undercooked. There are pieces in there that are like... It's not too salty. This has way more flavor than the last meal. The chicken is also very well seasoned. There's this weird lingering taste when you eat the chicken. The sauce on the chicken is the best part. Why does it taste like cough medicine a little? Why does it taste like that? <laughs> Why does it taste like that? Definitely the most flavorful thing on the plate. Yo, what makes this shit out. even more funnier is that they got women doing this shit. What this flavor is. I need to know what she put. She said that shit got a lingering taste to it. Nigga, that shit got fucking nut on it or some shit. I don't know, nigga. Like, fuck. This bitch with the bees. And this chicken, bro. I definitely will finish nigga, this. That shit got a lingering this one looks like smell. It's maybe like a solid $10. And I'll say that because of the chicken. This meal maybe cost like $10. If they got this chicken from like some fancy spot, it's probably like the full $15. If I had to leave something out, it would be whatever she marinated it in. It definitely soaked up the flavors, but it soaked up the wrong flavors. If you got two more dollars in the budget, I need some greens. Just looking at it, I would say asparagus. You can get a head of asparagus for like one to two dollars. With the chicken, I would have made maybe barbecue sauce chicken. The barbecue sauce is worth like one twenty nine, and that probably would have. But you'd even eat it. If I was doing my version, I would swap the chicken for like garbanzo beans. I would have given. Bro, the eight. version I would swap the chicken for like garbanzo beans. Nah, she's been in the trenches for too long, bro. She said she would trade the chicken for some fucking beans. Nah, they these niggas need to get you out the hood. I ain't gonna lie, you over here eating beans and shit. I would have given this a- You need to eat greens. Nigga, I eat broccoli, nigga, the fuck? 
And I eat asparagus, nigga. And in in um, um string beans, nigga. Eight if that aftertaste of that chicken wasn't crazy. On a scale of one to ten, I would give it a seven and a half. The point five is coming from the seasoning of the chicken. That sauce is really good. I would give this meal a six point two. Two for a sprinkle sprinkle. Yeah. Okay. Damn. I decided to make shepherd's pie. I know what y'all are gonna say. I already know it's a white people meal, but here's the thing. Sometimes you have to adopt the way what that, is that Christopher Columbus stole all of our stuff. Sometimes you have to cook and make it better. I am Caribbean, so I did put scotch bonnet in here. I definitely put Goya in here. And then another special ingredient, almond milk. I actually have the receipt right here. For the ground turkey, it costs $4.19. Ground turkey. The pasta sauce, that was $1.39. The mixed vegetables, yes, they're frozen. Mind your business. 87 cents. I used shredded cheese, so that was $2.89. The yellow potatoes were $4.29. Oh, there's potatoes in that bitch. In total, it is a $13.89. What's a black version of shepherd's pie? Shep's pie. There's layers to me and there's layers to my meal. Listen, y'all better eat this and enjoy it. Thank God we have meat. People, we get it somewhere. Moussaka. I think you're right. <laughs> so at first I was confused because I thought it was pizza. I'm assuming it's what is called shepherd's pie. Shepherd's pie is definitely. Why'd she say moussaka? Definitely a white dish. This is a white meal. However, the peas inside say black to me though. I don't know what it is. Like. <laughs> I never personally had shepherd's pie. So nigga, black, white, Asian, that shit look ass, nigga. I'm not going on. This is going to be my first time having it. said pizza. You big ass. Like, nigga, how the fuck that look like pizza, too? Then it. I don't know what sauce this is. It looks like some sort of cheese sauce. I'm going to tear that up, too. I'm avoiding the cheese as much as possible. Like, I don't want my booty to squeeze. Nigga, what? Yo, booty to squeeze. Cheese be making. Oh, she's, she's probably lactose like, intolerant. Nigga, that's still pinned? Yeah, because that's the pin of shame. You said your throat is bored. You're gay. You're gay. Crazy how for budget meals they only got blacks. What the fuck am I tripping or? <laughs> what you mean blacks? What the fuck? What you mean blacks, bro? They only got blacks. <laughs> Yo, yeah, niggas is wild. Yo. <laughs> Yo, this shit is crazy, bro. BLM, bro. BLM. It's pretty good. It tastes like a struggle meal, only in the sense that, like, there's not a lot of flavor profiles there. Taste wise, I don't know. It's a little confusing. I ain't gonna lie, that cheese look nice. Like, she grilled that cheese nicely. Because it's like when I eat the meat and the vegetables and stuff, it's sweet. But then I she see, what you be like, dang, that's too sweet. Let me add some seasoning to like balance it out. The veggies taste frozen. And I say that as like a little veggie snob, but still seasoned well. And seasoning can save anything. First of all, is these real potatoes? Because that matters. But it tastes like instead of milk, she used water. The potato texture is really, really lovely. As y'all can see, like the mashed potatoes, it's a little still. But we ain't gonna get into that. It's good. Like, the meat is cooked very, very well. It's well seasoned. Like, the meat here, but what is the meat? It's more mashed potatoes than it is meat. I knew she was being cheap because she barely put meat. Meat and cheese is expensive. This meal definitely costs the full thing. Yo, now, on some real shit, though, like, if I'm being cheap to get some eats, bro, like, what am I, relig what am I realistically eating? On some real shit, I might eat some Vienna sausages. Pause some vienna sausages and go get some 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 craft mac and cheese bro Kraft mac and cheese like three dollars and but but this is what i do i fry the vienna sausages i slice them up and i fry them super sanction that's how i know you're a jamaican Just trying to show you bro or if if not that if i don't because sometimes i don't have craft mac and cheese like right now i got no more i got no more so I would probably eat like I did that, literally like probably like Tuesday, bowl of beef and the right rice with some ketchup. $15. Overall. Bro, guys, nigga, this is what I'm trying to show you. Look, look, look. 
let's get to two out of 50 let's get the word word at 120 subs we are going to be playing both outlast one and two and then at 200 subs i will be redoing the what's that shit called the hot chip challenge newest version it's not bad it's missing well you know about bun and cheese oh bun and cheese i got that i got that in the crib right now i got i got spice bun spice bun and a regular bun into it on scale of one to ten i would give this a 7.7 7. bun Lack and flavor cheese profiles knocks it down a little bit yo give her a good six and a half tomorrow Why is literally on a plate oh, tomorrow man. is literally september <laughs> Damn, she won. Y'all, sorry, you can make me bless that. Bro. I didn't think that. I, I didn't think that 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 fake cake ass bullshit was better than the other one, with the yellow rice and the chicken. Though. Definitely don't disagree. I don't. I think we need a rerun. I think we need a recount because me losing, unacceptable. I want to thank my mom because she's the one who introduced me to shepherd's pie. Do y'all want to play? Do, do you guys want to try it? You need something to drink after this, cause it is a little drunk. Right. What do you have to say? Do you want to fight? Like, do you want to fight? She said, "Keep it real." We can do it. Oh no. Hey, keep it real. We can do it. Nah, they still about. To, she about to fucking volley her. Nigga, y'all over here showing the recipe. Niggas do not want this shit. Okay. Nigga, YouTube name is Cocoa Butter. Sipping the peace soda. The niggas inside, they gon' hide till the heat is over. I'm around till the beat is over. Two shit up back, same price.